All right, today I'm going to talk about <laughs> about a new tow rig. So um, I thought what I'd do is just kind of talk about it, tell a little bit about what it's back, and then we'll take you know some. I'll show you some video of it, and then kind of talk about uh, my thoughts or whatever after. But anyway, so to start off with, so I've driven. I've, I like diesels. I've had diesels for I think close to 30 years. Um, my first one was a '97 Dodge with Cummins in it. Um, and then I've had several since then, and they've always been Dodge. Always driven Dodge, like the Cummins. The last one I had was a 2020, and it had um, the high output. It was a 3500. All the previous ones before that were 2500s. That was a 3500, had the air ride in the back, which was a leveling system, so when you got weight on it, it would, uh, it would actually raise, you know, fill the bags up and keep the truck level. And that truck was amazing at pulling. I mean, I really liked it. it Held the weight good when I pulled campers, whatever I was pulling, um, work stuff. It was it was impressive. By far the best out of the ones that had. So anyway, kind of changing some things up a little bit. Um, we'll talk about some of it this video, and I've got some others. I'll share a little more in some other videos. But uh, so anyway, I so I decided to buy a new uh, tow rig, and. What I bought <laughs> was a Ford F450. Um, so duly uh, rated for, I mean, it's, it'll, hold, it'll hold the weight really well. So we've got, you know, a long, a 36 foot gooseneck that we can put our Jeeps on, which isn't terrible. My other truck was okay, but this would do better. Um, but I kind of wanted to do some things, possibly um, some other things that I possibly want to do. And so anyway, this, I kind of figured this platform would work really well. Um, so that's the route I went. Um, like I said, I love diesels. I mean, I like Jeeps, but I like, I've, I've had diesels forever. Um, I've had some, some that are lifted, um, quite a few of them that are lifted. Uh, some that have done performance, last, you know, performance stuff to them. Uh, I think my old one had you know, 80 horse injectors and five inch exhaust and chipped and a whole bunch of stuff. And they had a lot of power. Um, but anyway, so I'm kind of looking forward to this. Um, but I got some plans for it. It's going to be, I think it's going to look really awesome and it's going to work really good for what I'm wanting to do. So anyway, let's, let's take a look at what this thing looks like. So anyway, that's the truck. Um, uh, it's a 24 Ford F450, the limited edition, so it's loaded. Super nice, super plush. Um, so I'm, I'm excited. I've never owned one. I've never owned a Ford before. Um, so far, I'm really happy with it. Still, still like the Dodges I had. I still love the Dodges. Um, but it'll be fun. It'll be fun to do something a little different. And the reason I kind of went with the 450. Ford is because the Dodge, they have a 4500, but it's a chassis truck. And I wanted to go that route, but I wanted the pickup bed rather than the chassis truck. And there's some differences between the chassis truck and, and like what Ford has. So that's kind of, that's part, that's a big share of the reason that I went with the Ford 450, as well as it's got a wider front axle. So it turns way, way sharper than anything I had. It's actually, you'd think it'd be harder to park and everything, but in some ways it's easier just because it turns so sharp. And that'll come in handy when you're pulling a long trailer and you have to swing out past and you can crank it right around and come right back. So um, that'll be kind of nice. That's, I mean, I can already see that's going to be really nice. Uh, Power-wise, I've driven enough now that it's it's got a lot of power. Um, they told me 500 horse with uh, 1,200 foot-pounds of torque, and it's got it. It's got a lot of power. Um, so pretty excited about, pretty excited to get on the build on this. We've got some things in the works and. Then I'll be able to show you what we've done and kind of where we're going with it. But uh, anyway, yeah, it's it's, it's going to be good. So 
excited. This is this is uh, this will be fun. It'd be nice to be able to use pull the jeeps and uh, and some other things. So anyway, so that's kind of what I wanted to share with you today. Um, so if you want to see what's coming up with uh, the build and what I'm going to do, you better hit that subscribe button, and uh, so you can see what we're you know what's going to what we're going to do to it. And it's going to be it's going to be pretty awesome. I'm I'm excited. I, I think you do a few things. These things look pretty awesome. So anyway, I'll leave it at that, and we'll catch you on the next one.